time in 95 years, young people are staying and moving to North Dakota rather than leaving. We've uncovered some amazing census numbers revealing a dramatic shift in the migration of young people in North Dakota. Valley News Team's Neil Carlson takes us to the Career Expo in Grand Forks to show us what's happening. 1,500 sophomores from high schools across the Northern Valley flocked into the Alara Center for the Career Expo. It was a chance for them to talk with regional employers about career possibilities. Naturally, many high school sophomores don't have a clear idea of what they'll do after graduation. So do you plan on sticking around here after you finish your education? I'm not sure. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. Do you plan on sticking around here after you finish your education? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Anything in particular you know that you want to do already? Or? I want to be a doctor. Organizers say this career expo is getting larger every year, and it's getting all these students to at least begin thinking about their future plans. And then that gives them a couple years of high school to try to figure out what classes they can be taking to better prepare for the okay. future and look at colleges that will meet that need. It may be at least one factor that's caused a shift in census numbers the state hasn't seen in 95 years. In fact, more and more young people are choosing to stay and work right here in North Dakota. Compared to previous numbers, the numbers now are simply amazing. Kevin Iverson of the Census Office says for the first time since around 1920, the state has more young people ages 20 to 34 staying and moving into the state than leaving. And he says that's not just because of the oil boom. He says it's happening in every county across North Dakota, which has a lot of jobs to offer. 19,000 jobs that are listed, and that's so it's listed those ones that we know about. Those aren't the ones that people have in their back pocket. So there's lots of opportunities in the state. It's a new generation and a new workforce that's choosing to call North Dakota home. In Grand Forks, Neil Carlson, Valley News Live. However, Minnesota isn't doing as well. Statistics show that Minnesota is losing 9,300 people every year in the 18 to 24 age group. Tonight, 